Well, I'm our thanks to Mars. Um, Paul Manafort, if you're not familiar with him, I don't see how anybody couldn't be, but there may be some skips out there. He was involved in the Trump campaign uh, for a while. And he is now a political prisoner. He is uh, being kept in solitary confinement 23 hours a day. And he is on trial. Uh, they claim for bank fraud and this and that. Bank fraud and tax evasion, that's what they're claiming. But this is a political show trial, that's all it is. Paul Manafort is a political prisoner. Make no mistake about it. I can't believe this is, this is happening in this country. But anyway, uh, last witness called to the stand was J. Philip Aliff, a CPA from at Paul Manafort's long-standing tax preparation agency, KWC of Richmond, Virginia. His time in Shalong and the last witness's test, testimony, nothing of particular interest seemed to be occurring at all. Aliff was mostly providing foundational testimony regarding the basic functions of a tax preparation company. Prosecutors then moved on to specifics and attempted to publish one of Manafort's e-file forms. Judge T.S. Ellis III reads weariness all but amazed the courtroom as he denied the request complete with an actual and pronounced finger wag before shouting, No, you move it along. And... He cut, he cut the, uh, and he cut it short. I'm having trouble with the, uh, sight here. It keeps jumping around. So I'm not going to try to read this. I don't like it when they, uh, have the sight and it, you know, bounces up and down with all these ads. Up and down, up and down, up and down. Drives me crazy. So, they're doing anything they can to get at Trump, and uh, this Manafort guy, he is being held as a political prisoner, They're trying to turn him to go against Trump and all this. That's what this is about. And Mueller, in my opinion, should be sent to prison until the uh, sun never shined again. Until somebody becomes a red giant and there are no prisoners. That's the way I see it. You don't hold political prisoners in this country yet. We've seen it. We saw it when the, uh, those guys out west that, uh, Trump pardoned, and we see it with Paul Manafort. These are political prisoners. No ifs, ands, or buts. You can complain all you like, you're not going to change what I think about this. Sorry. I'm not quite awake yet, either. Well, let's see how this goes, but it didn't go very well on third day, at least. I'm artifacts of Mars. I can't believe this is happening in this country. <laughs>